Hey everyone, Drew with GeoArm, and I am back to talk to you about the initial setup of the GeoAlarm system. Um, go ahead and get it powered on, and once you do, the first thing they're going to want you to do is set up your wireless network. If you're not using a Wi-Fi network, obviously you can click skip up in the top right. Uh, but if you are, choose your Wi-Fi network and go ahead and enter your password. And remember, that password is going to be case sensitive, so make sure that you enter it correctly. Um, but uh, once you do get it entered correctly, uh, and we proceed to the next screen here, um, then you will press the check mark to the right, and it will start the joining procedure. Uh, go ahead and hit that check mark like so. Joining Wi-Fi uh, will appear on the screen. Uh, when it is joined uh, and it's it's happy, it will say that uh, it, it has joined the network. So uh, we're going to wait for that to happen here. All right, there it is. It's joined now. So now what we're going to do is we're going to enter a four-digit arming and disarming code. This is the master code. It will also be used for programming on this panel. So make sure that whatever code you enter, you remember it because it's going to be responsible for several things. Um, in this case, I'm just going to make it one, two, three, four, so that it's nice and easy here for the video. Um, so you'll enter it once. And then they're going to have you re-enter it again for confirmation. Okay, so now that the passcode has been created. The next thing that they want you to do in the setup of the geo alarm panel is move on to enrolling a sensor. Um, it can be whatever you'd like. Obviously, there's several options to choose from there. Door, window, motion, glass break, key fob. Um, if you want to enroll your doorbell, if you, if you have one. Um, the medical device, uh, the smoke CO, uh, the water flood device, um, the translator, or a Z-Wave device. Anything you want to enroll. They just want to see you enroll something. So what you do here is just go ahead and pull the tabs on that device and it'll enroll. I'm just going to set this as the garage door um, and uh, what we'll do is uh, we'll skip the point where it's mounting because I'm going to have a separate video to show you how to actually do that. Um, but uh, this is how you actually get the initial enrollment of the sensor in there. Um, once this little video showing you what they're wanting um, in terms of the installation for the device, which is actually a really cool feature, they're giving you setup videos showing you how to do it prior. Um, but uh, if those videos don't help you enough, obviously I have videos that I've made as well. You can check those out. Um, but at this point, you can install your device. Um, and then you just press Done, which is located down in the bottom right hand side of it. And then the garage door has been added now. Now uh, you see a Finish button at the bottom right. If you don't want to continue enrolling sensors here and you just want to proceed, you can click Finish. If you do want to continue enrolling sensors, obviously that's the place you do it. But at this point, um, you can do a walk test to test all your sensors with triggering them, I'm sorry, with the monitoring center. Um, you can choose yes or no, it's completely up to you. Um, I genuinely just live test it or I'll place my account on test first. But um, that's how you set up the Geo Alarm system. Uh, very, very easy to do. If you have any questions or you need anything, please let us know in the comments below. Please like and subscribe to our page for helpful programming and installation videos product reviews, monitoring, products, and more. Visit www.geoarm.com or call 877-443-6276. That's www.geoarm.com or 877-443-6276. Geoarm, the worldwide leader in DIY security.